YouTube, what up, man? It's the Martin 405 back with another video, man. Just an update to everything I've done so far to the old Durango. So, that being said, of course, man, you know, I changed the color. Everybody that has watched was the red line red first. Uh, went with the charcoal gray. Uh, turn these on right quick. Um, also with right with the uh, color change, there's a couple of things that I had done as well. Um, um, here recently also. Did the Dodge in there the same color as the car. Um, I don't know how good that is showing up, but got my valve stems. Also, say Dodge on there if I can get that clear up. Still need to clean these. The rims haven't got on that side yet. It's a nice day out here, so I was shining her up. those um also these on there well flexible uh lights on there you got all your different settings which i went over these before but i'm gonna go back to the blue also did the uh drl lights which ones down here at the bottom these are controlled by bluetooth and of course the ones at the top which i would have wished they were controlled by bluetooth but they're controlled by remote um outside of that anything else that i've done on the outside um had all of my mirrors on my side trim also repainted anybody who's ever had um, a durango as well as Pretty much any kind of car you know those plastic pieces will start fading on you pretty well started to get some stuff to kind of polish them up but uh decided to just get them painted man figured that'll last a little bit longer uh but all in all paint came out pretty good man um the wet sanding and buffing it to giving it you know a little bit more of a, a shine to it which it already looked good from just you know what i mean freshly being painted but i wanted that uh that high reflection there uh also went with one of the uh heads up displays here uh what have i done uh went with these also because all of these were actually of course same color as the car uh but i just got the little uh covers to go on there because i didn't know how it would look uh, with them being painted which i may actually change that and uh pull those back off of there and actually have my painter actually uh color match those or not really so much color match but actually paint those and get rid of those uh covers um of course got my decals on there i let people know to check out the channel uh tinted tail lights um, still looking into getting that one done. Didn't even really think about those. Uh, but I actually found a place on Amazon, eBay, Amazon, one of those where I actually get that too. So I may actually tint that as well. Uh, recently changed out my backup camera, the one that I had before. Um, in my last video, uh, one was getting kind of cloudy as well as um, at nighttime, I really couldn't see anything. This one has, of course, the LEDs on there. So not only that, but a plain as an HD, you know, really high quality camera, which I can vouch for that. It is a much better picture. Um, also got these, which the clip in there. Um, LED uh, license plate uh, lights. Because my, you know, factory ones aren't as bright as they possibly could be. Um, and that was actually factoring into uh, 
not seeing anything with the other backup camera as well. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Um, as far as interior, um, anybody that's watched any of my videos, I have a couple videos on Tesla style screen. So put that in. Got all of my Mopar uh, symbols done. Uh, I think it's Patriotic Customs. I may be getting that wrong. I'll throw that link in the description. If you guys want to get some work done, he does pretty much everything. He can do the badges for the outside of the car. Um, the only ones that I got done were the uh, steering wheel ones. Um, the Mopar ones. I got all of my carbon fiber stuff off of uh, eBay. Um, I got my... Uh, shift decal i got this off of amazon um of course with these here i got these off of amazon but of course he did these it's about time to clean those again um and then of course got those back there um what else um along with the paint i had him paint these interior pieces so all of these are color matched as well these and my doors as well as my uh, door locks a piece over there and this piece here I uh, was wanting to kind of get this stuff painted without really doing very much uh, or should I say doing too much and having it really be an overkill you know what I mean I don't want to paint everything in there there still may be a few other things that uh, I actually do go with that color uh you guys can drop some comments in the uh comment section let me know what uh you guys' thoughts are what things you may paint or uh, what things you guys may have uh have painted in your durango but uh i was almost thinking about my uh, uh window and lock uh buttons here doing these pieces thought about doing these pieces but it's like, well, I don't know if I do this piece then to do something up here. So then that way this kind of doesn't uh, stand out too much. So it's like, well, we'll see. Uh, but if I do uh, these over here, then I may just do the certain pieces. So then that way I don't have to mess with any of this. You know, got to coordinate, got to coordinate. Uh, but outside of that... Uh, wait till all this virus and mask wearing stuff is over with. Hopefully, one day soon. Uh, I have a flag up there, man. Uh, we went to Jamaica on our anniversary, or should I say for our honeymoon, uh, a couple of years ago. Man, if you haven't been, I suggest you go. But, uh, let me see, what else have I done? Uh, outside of that so let him uh paint the top here which it's a little dirty uh, i had to clean that get that wiped down uh had him paint the top black so also plan on covering the uh getting some uh a wrap put on my hood to where it just does this inside piece or well, maybe a gloss black doing this inside piece to where it wraps around this body line here so on both of these all of this will be black so i have a video coming up soon whenever i uh get that stuff and get that put on or have a video of me putting that on but i want to go there um do this body piece here and then maybe go up so then that way it kind of blends in to where all of this is black going up um, so that's one thing that I plan on doing, uh, since we're getting into things, oh, uh, but also had him leave my antenna that gray as well, uh, but getting into the things that I plan on doing now, um, so hood vinyl, uh, still have to, Head back to the stereo shop 
and uh, have him do my measurements. I'm, uh, actually put two boxes. Oh, let me throw this in here. I'm gonna turn the lights off. But shit, yeah, I'm gonna have him put two boxes on either side, which I already know what you're thinking. Uh, being that the uh, emergency release for the gas, the uh, fuel doors on this side. Uh, before I had it painted, I actually put my spring back on there and, you know, I'm pretty sure um, if you're anything like me and you've watched any of these videos on YouTube and you have a Durango, that that spring on your fuel door uh, comes off. So uh, before I had it painted, I went in, took that gas tank door off, and had all of that fixed. And since then, I haven't had any issues with that opening. Um, let me take this off before I have him do that. Maybe, maybe not. But I plan on having him build something. So then if I do, you know, worst case scenario, I'll have to get back in there. It won't be that hard. But I'm going to have him do a box on this side as well as one on this side. Don't really know how that's going to look yet. Um, and how that's going to come out. But I do notice that there's a bit of an indention here on this side versus the side over here. But, you know, the uh, guy that I plan on taking it to, he's done some, some pretty amazing work. So uh, whatever he can do, it'll be pretty sweet. I'll be bringing you that video as well. But I plan on going with two eights i don't want to go too crazy uh, but at the same time wanted some some decent sound you know coming from back here especially with uh putting that stereo in here so um have to get this straight uh, i'm doing installs so uh buddy of mine that has a honda or whatever i changed out all of his speakers stereo and all of that good stuff which i'll probably start putting some of that work on here as well uh but i actually got to cut some of these out because with the uh kickers that he put in there the six by nines these are the, his covers won't actually fit so that's why i have those back here my good old tools old terrible backup camera i need to throw this in the trash and then of course my front license plate that I also had uh, color matched to the color of the car as well, which I need to order my pieces and put them on here, which I'm trying to decide if I want to go with either saying Dodge, Durango, or uh, one or the other, or saying something else on there before I drop that in there. Um, but other than that, I'm gonna get the stereo stuff done. course so I can pull those back up yeah. uh serial stuff done um actually looking at rim and tire packages probably won't go too big but uh right now i'm looking at uh 24 inch rims on here which i've actually started looking at packages today uh the rim that i was looking at is actually around 26 and some change rims and tires but i'm pretty sure i can find a, a much better price if somewhere in the city um somewhere may a trip to uh texas or whatever if you know people aren't getting their rims here they're making that trip to texas and going down there and seeing omar or you know somebody else down that way but but yeah so rims um stereo need to hit back up the uh tent shop um trying to decide if not just going with a visor up top and then getting my two front uh, windows retinted or just tinting the whole front windshield which I think I may go that route because that'll actually kind of go in with the scheme that I'm going with as far as putting my vinyl my uh, gloss black vinyl on my hood and then having that run up to the black up top 
so but yeah man uh, that's pretty much what I've done so far I also want to get a, a oil catch can uh, a bit cold air intake uh, under I'm trying to decide also between um, the underglow or the rim lights uh, or maybe doing both which I don't know yet uh, majority of people that I've seen either have one or the other. There's a couple of people in uh, a couple of Dodge Durango groups that have been on Facebook that have both. And then some of them either have one or the other. So I'm trying to decide that as well. Uh, but outside of that, man, that'll pretty much be it. Um, outside of trying to figure out what other things I can do. Um, I've also been looking at different grills as well, too, if I wanted to change out that grill, which I may, may not, don't know yet. Um, so I may do that, change out my grills and see what else they got out there that I can actually, you know what I mean, change up. So but other than that, man, just a quick little video of things that I have done and stuff that I plan on doing. But I need to finish getting her shined up. Came out pretty, pretty clean, man. She cleans up pretty nice. And not too shabby. But I need to find the uh, little car scenes here. We got a couple of little uh, spots to jump off down here. Uh, Cars and coffee, a couple of different uh, areas the cats go to. They just get out there and showcase the work that they've done to their vehicles. So, but that's about it. Till the next video, man. I'll holler at y'all. Uh, again, comment, like, subscribe. You know, the whole nine. Everybody that has subscribed to the channel so far, man. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate the love, all the views. Uh, man much more content to come uh and i'll keep y'all updated man not only with uh stuff that i do to my car but stuff i plan on doing to my wife's car so much more content coming also plan on looking at snatching rims and stuff for her car and doing a couple things to her car as well uh but she's looking into or, you know, wants us to look into getting a, uh, a Tahoe within the next few years. So that'll just be more content to the channel. But appreciate y'all, man, checking out the, uh, the video for the day. If you haven't checked out the rest of the videos, I have a couple of them. Uh, not only somewhere in this video, but just check out the channel. Again, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll get it y'all next time. Peace.